Hi, uh, today we are going to see the top 10 web hostings. Number one, GoDaddy. GoDaddy is an American publicly traded internet domain registered and web hosting company headquartered in Arizona and incorporated in Delaware. As of December 2021, GoDaddy has more than 20 million customers and over 9,000 employees worldwide. GoDaddy was founded in 1997 in Phoenix, Arizona by entrepreneur Bob Parsons. Prior to founding GoDaddy, Parsons has sold his financial software services company Parsons Technology to Intuit for $65 million in 1994. He came out of his retirement in 1997 to launch Jomax Technology named after Rod in Phoenix, Arizona, which became GoDaddy Group. GoDaddy received a strategic investment in 2011 from five equity funds, KKR, Silver Lake and Technology Crossover Ventures. The company headquarters was located in Scottsdale, Arizona up until April 2021, when then moved to Temple, Arizona. In 1999, a group of employees at Jomax Technologies were brainstorming, sorry, brainstorming and decided to change the company name. One employee said, how about Big Daddy? However, the domain name had already been purchased, so Parsons replied, how about GoDaddy? The name was available, so he bought it. Parsons said that the company stuck with the name because it made people smile and remember it. The company changed its name branding from Jomax Technologies to GoDaddy in February 2006. And GoDaddy's original logo featured a cartoon style man with uh, messy hair wearing sunglasses in January 2022. GoDaddy unveiled a new logo with a simple sans serif type accompanied by a heart shaped design that spells out Go. In 2001, soon after network solutions were no longer the only place to register a domain, GoDaddy was approximately the same size as competitors Dotster and Eno. In April 2005, GoDaddy became the largest ICANN accredited register on in the internet. As of 2018, GoDaddy is the world's largest web boss by market share with over 62 million registered domains. In March 2018, Amazon Web Series announced that GoDaddy is migrating the vast majority of its infrastructure to AWS as part of multi-year transaction. In 2013, GoDaddy was reported as the largest ICANN credit registered in the world, the size of the four times their closest competitor. They also have a 270,000 square foot facility in Phoenix, Arizona. Uh, they have, uh, so far they have acquired uh, some companies and um, some they have merged. Uh, as per the reports, uh, they have acquired uh, companies called Loku, Afternic, Media Temple, Canary, uh, Mad Meme, Alto, uh, and there are much more. On January 2007, GoDaddy deactivated the domain of computer security site syslist.org, taking 250,000 pages of security content offline. The shutdown resulted from a complaint from MySpace to GoDaddy regarding 56,000 usernames and passwords posted a week earlier to full disclosure mailing list and archived on seslist.org site. As well as many other websites, seslist.org administrator Gordon Leon, who goes by the handle Feuda, provided logos to CNET showing GoDaddy re deactivated the domain 52 seconds after leaving him a voicemail and he had to go to great lengths to get the site reactivated. GoDaddy General Counsel Christine Jones stated that GoDaddy's terms of 
services reserves the right to terminate your access to services at any time without notice for any reason whatsoever the site seslist.origin is now hosted with linode the suspension of seslist.org led leon to create node.id.com a consumer activities website where dissatisfied GoDaddy customers and whistleblowers from GoDaddy staff share their experience on July 12, 2011. An article the Register reported that shortly after Bob Parsons' sale of GoDaddy, the company purchased Crip site NoDaddy. The site had returned a top 5 result on Google for a search for GoDaddy. In March 2010, GoDaddy stopped registering China domains due to high amount of personal information that is required to register in that country. Some called it a public relation campaign since it closely followed Google's revolt in China. GoDaddy top lawyer Christine Jones told Congress, we were having to contact Chinese users to ask for their personal information and begrudgingly give it to China's authorities. We decided we didn't want to become an agent of the Chinese government. GoDaddy resumed registering China domains names in February 2016 as part of its push into the Asia market. On January 27, 2015, GoDaddy released its Super Bowl ad on YouTube called Journey Home. The commercial featured a retriever puppy named Buddy who was bounced out the back of a truck after making a journey home. His owners are relieved because they just sold him on a website. They built with GoDaddy. GoDaddy claims the ad was supposed to be funny and attempt to make fun of all the puppies shown in Super Bowl ads. Most notably, but Visa's famous Super Bowl ad also featured a retriever puppy. The ad found very few fans from the online community. Animal advocates took to social media calling the ad disgusting. Callouts and the commercial advocated puppy meals. An online petition collected 42,000 signatures. GoDaddy CEO Blake Ring wrote a blog entry later that day promising that the commercials would not air during the Super Bowl. He wrote on his blog at the end of the day, our purpose at GoDaddy is to help small businesses around the world build a successful online presence. We hope our ad would increase awareness of that cause. However, we underestimated the emotional response and we heard that loud and clear. He goes on to say that Buddy was purchased from a reputable breeder and is part of the GoDaddy family as chief companion officer. Number 2. Bluehost Bluehost is a web hosting company owned by Endurance International Group. It was one of the 20 largest web hosts in 2015 and was collectively hosting over uh, 2 million domains in 2010. Bluehost was among those studied in the analysis of web-based hosting services in collaborative online learning programs. Bluehost sells shared hostings, WordPress hosting, VPS hosting, dedicated hosting, and WooCommerce hosting, as well as professional marketing services. Their servers are powered by PHP, HTTP, NGA, NX. Matt Heaton first conceived Bluehost in 1996. However, he first created two other web hosts, 50max.com and zerocatch.com, before finally settling on Bluehost in 2003. In 2009, Bluehost introduced a new feature called CPU throttling. CPU throttling refers to the process of reducing users CPU usage in whenever the particular user is putting too much server resources at one time at that particular time Bluehost would freeze or drastically reduce client sites CPU usage substantially 
This effectively shut down clients' websites or stood on Blue server for several hours throughout the day. In 2010, Blue Oast was acquired by Endurance International Group. In June 2011, company founder Matt Heaton announced on his blog that he was stepping down as CEO to focus on the company hosting platforms, design, and technical structure. While COO Dan Handy took over as CEO. In 2013, Bluehost introduced VPS and a dedicated server hosting. In January 2015, Endurance International Group appointed Mike Olson as CEO of Bluehost, while Dan Handy moved to enterprise-wide mobile development for small businesses. In January 2017, the company announced that it will lay off 440 Bluehost employees at Utah. in an effort to consolidate its business to improve customer support in march 2019 blue host appeared in newsweek article that condemned the hosting company for censoring the web pages of some of their customers who were believed to be citizens of countries that the united states government had listed as roach status in february 2011 blue host took down a religious website that they were hosting on his servers after receiving thousands of complaints when that website posted comments blaming gays and lesbians for an earthquake in New Zealand in March 2015 bluehost was hacked by Syrian electric electronic army also act was see a ca claim that these servers were hosting ter- uh, terrorist websites Syrian electronic army posted screenshot of the attack on Twitter. Twitter in January 2019 the magazine website Planet uncovered client side vulnerability in some of the largest hosting companies in the world. Bluehost, Dreamhost, Oscator, iPage and OVH. Since their founding in 2003, Bluehost has continually innovated new ways to deliver on our mission. to empower people to fully harness the web based on orem uta we provide um, comprehensive tools to millions of users throughout the world so anyone no wise or pro can get on the web and thrive with our web hosting packages their vast team is dedicated to helping our customers around the clock 24 into 7 so we can be the best web hosting to their customers at all times number 3 oscator oscator is a austin based provider of shared reseller virtual private server and dedicated web hosting with an additional presence in austin texas oscator was founded in october 2002 by brent oxley who was then a student at florida atlantic university In 2006, the company moved from the original office in Boca Raton, Florida, to a new 20,000 square foot building in Austin, Texas, in June 2006. The company opened its first international office in Canada. In 2008, Inc. dot magazine ranked Osgata in its list of fastest growing companies at 21 in the United States and one in the Austin Sugarland Bay Town, Texas. The same year Oscator decided to make their hosting service green hosting by working with integrated ecosystem market services. In 2008, Oscator prepared for competition companies touting themselves as providing unlimited hosting services. Founder Brent Oxley was adamant about being able to back up an unlimited option prior to offering service named as such as increased staffing. He suggested that this move increase sales by at least 30%. In 2010, in an office was added in Austin, Texas in May 2011. Oscator started operation in India with Uh, its office in Nashik, Maharashtra, uh, and a data center. On July 2012, uh, 
yeah, on July 13, 2012, Oscata was sold to Endurance International Group for an aggregate purchase price of $299.8 million, of which $227.3 million was paid in cash at the closing on 21 June 2012. CEO and founder Brent Oxley announced the sale of Oscator, advised employees and users not to worry in part because Oxley would still own the buildings Oscator used. He said he wanted to travel the world before he had children. He was also candid about the failures in creating stable billing and register portions of Oscator and hoped that endurance might fix those. In 2015, Oscator launched Optimized WP, a set of tools for building and maintaining WordPress websites. By the end of 2015, EIG, that means the Endurance International Group, launched local Oscator sites in Brazil, or, well, Russia, India, China, Turkey, uh, and Mexico as well. As of 2019, Oscator also offered a web hosting services in United Kingdom and Australia. In 2006, Oscator suffered from a Trojan attack that affected more than 200 machines. In May 2012, the computer hacker group UG Nazi claimed responsibility for hacking the web server of the web hosting billing software developer WHMCS in an apparent social engineering attack involving Oscata. A member of the group Cosmo called WHMC's hosting provider impersonating a senior employee they were subsequently granted root access to WHMCS web server after providing information for identity verification. UG Nazi later leaked publicly WHMCS SQL database containing user information and 500,000 customer credit cards, website files and cPanel configuration. Uh, after this issue, WHMCS emailed members to change their passwords. Since its acquisition by Endurance International, Osgator has suffered an increased incidence of server outages and downtime, notably on uh, I think around 2nd August 2013 and December 31st 2013. Endurance International Group's data center in Provo, UTAH, experienced network outages that affected thousands of customers of Bluehost, Osgator, Osmonster, and uh, JustHost. In January 2009, TechCrunch reported that Paulo Yubilo, a well known bug hunter, found serious vulnerabilities at Bluehost, Dreamhost, uh, OVH, iPage, and Oscator. Some web hosting plans like those provided by Oscator will let you create an unlimited number of free email addresses. Other charge more of creating any email addresses or include a small number in the hosting plan and charge for extra uh, well they have around yeah they have 20 they have they will be working 24 into 7 and 365 days and if you ask how can i transfer my domain to osgator they have set up a complete guide on how to transfer your domain including what you need to do beforehand how to get it started how to check its status and any troubleshooting notes. If we take on, uh, well, uh, we'll check out what the uh, what the customers have to say about the Oscator. Uh, Jen Pablo Rogers has said 
excellent server services fast and 110 percent reliable servers love the way the company treats customers and jim edelston has said i love oscator and I have never had an issue and support is awesome uh, jahzeel galarza has said it's a pretty great for platform i highly recommend it for any new user who wants to build his own business tool online uh, matthew hudson has said very easy to set up i had no experience with hosting before signing up with the hostgator but they have made everything seem simple corey jens johnson has said i absolutely love hostgator seriously great web hosting at affordable prices with the best customer service oh that's it number four hostinger hostinger international limited is an employee owned web hosting provider and an internet domain registrar established in 2004 hostinger is the parent company of w uh, sorry triple uh, zero web host uh, niaga hoster and webling founded in Kaunas, Lithuania in 2004, the firm was originally named Osking Media in 2007. Its subsidiary, Triple Zero Webhost, was established Osking 24 and the subsidiary was launched in 2008 in the United States with data centers in Ashwale, North Carolina and in the UK. In 2014, the subsidiary Weblink is launched in Brazil. In 2019, Ostinger converted its Apache HTTP service to Lightspeed Server to increase the server's performance. Lightspeed Server, uh, Lightspeed's web server LSWS, is proprietary web server software. It is fourth most popular web server estimated to be used by 10% of website as of July 2021. LSWS Lightspeed Web Server is developed by privately held Lightspeed Technologies. The software uses the same configuration format as Apache HTTP server and is compatible with most Apache features. An open source variant is also available. LSWS was released in 2003 and in August 2008 it became the 16th most popular web server. In November 2016, Lightspeed's market share grew from 0.39% to 3.29, increasing its position from 10th to 4th most popular web server according to Netcraft in 2007 sorry 2017 a team from hong kong polytechnic university found it to be one of the six most popular web servers and it was it estimated by a team at rwth archain university to be running 9.2 percent of all http enabled website as of april 2020 lsws was used by 69.3% of website QUIC and 47.6% of website using HTTP. According to the latest Netcraft web survey, Lightspeeds never grew up 30% of global market shares. Coming back to Ostinger, in mid-2020, Ostinger partnered with Google Cloud Platform in 2021, Ostinger was listed as one of the fastest growing companies in Europe. It offers website hosting services in over 170 countries. In 2021, a group of investors led by the German entrepreneurs Jochen Berger and Thomas Trohe invested in Ostinger. They have acquired 31% of Ostinger's share from long-time employees and have become members of the company's board. As of 2014, the company has four subsidiaries under its ownership. 
Ostinger is an employee owned Lithuanian establishment based in Kaunas. It was known as Ostin Media before it was rebranded in 2011. The company currently provides web hosting, VPs, cloud hosting service, and domain registration. 2007 Triple Zero Web Host The website was subject to a data breach of 13.5 million users in 2015, including their IP address, email address, and plain text password. Uh, other one is in 2008 hosting 24 website hosting platform in 2013 Naga Oster Indonesian web hosting company launched in 2013 2014 weblink web hosting brand launched in 2014 based in Brazil data centers hosting as a data center in seven locations around the world Brazil uh, Indonesia, Lithuania, uh, Netherlands, Singapore, UK, and US as well. Uh, there are uh, thousands of satisfied webmasters. Uh, they have a rating. Uh, Google rating, they have 4.8 ratings. And Trustpilot, they are given 4.2 rating. Post advice they are 4.6 and WP beginner uh, 5 out of 5. Now let's see what the customer has to say. Ostinga outperforms most of the competition. Tecrada has said. Excellent customer service and uptime. PCMac.com has said. From marketing to UI for managing your site, it feels like a premium host has said quick sprout and uh, hosting has uh, various offers and they have triple double XL with hosting sale uh, $2.99 per month uh, they have 30 day money bank guarantee as well and they have uh, services like free SSL, free migration, PHP speed boost and they also have the 24 into 7 and 365 days tech support, access management, backups, light speed, wordpress module, auto script installer, uh, e-commerce optimizations, Cloudflare CDN and DDoS protection, one click WordPress installation, uh, 99.9 uptime uh, guarantee, uh, and WP beginner asset. Ostinger is a reliable hosting company with years of experience in the shared hosting industry. Quick Sprout asset from the marketing to the UI for managing your site feels like a premium host and uh, they have various offers uh, 9.0.99 for month for email hosting you can check on their website through this at number 5 web.com Web.com Group Inc. is an American company headquartered in Jacksonville, Florida that provides domain name registration and web development services. Established in 1999 by Darren Brennan, the company was known as Website Pro Sync until early 2008 after acquiring an Atlanta-based company called Web.com changing its name to web.com which was founded in 1981 and formerly known as interland.inc web.com has 3.3 million subscribers as of 2016 and 3500 employees throughout the united states and in argentina canada and uk as of 2017 on june 21 2018 Web.com announced an agreement to be acquired by an affiliate of Series Capital Group LLC. The agreement was for 
dollar per share in all cash deal valued at approximately 2 billion dollars on august 2018 dip.com announced an amended agreement to be acquired by an affiliate of cyrus capital group llc for a revised amount of 28 dollar per share in cash and at the end of the go shop period web.com is based in jaconsville florida and incorporated in delaware and provides domain name registration and web development service among others the company caters to small medium sized businesses and offers a variety of subscription services including design hosting management e-commerce lead generation mobile commerce online advertising search engine optimization and social media solutions web.com reportedly had million subscribers in january 2016 the company has offices in more than 20 u.s states and in argentina canada ontario and nova and the uk including cardiff and wales web.com was stated as web on nasdaq david brown served as web.com's chief executive officer until early 2019 okmas found management was company's top shareholder with 18.64 percent of as of march 2017 in 2015 okumas and web.com agreed to appoint two independent directors to its board in may 2017 the company had 3500 employees and market capitalization of 1.1 billion dollars web.com has 1.1 1 1.21 billion valuation 1.21 billion dollars valuation as of june 2017 uh, as I said, uh, it's earlier called as Website Pros Inc. David Brown established Website Pros Inc. as predecessor the technology services company Atlantic Teleservice in Jacksonville in 1997. Brown served as CEO until 1999 when he sold the company to Website Pros via the venture and growth equipment equity investment firm Norwest Venture Partners. Website Pros was founded in 1999 by Darren Brennan. Brown joined the company's board of directors. The company planned to establish a chain of stores for people to access services to develop and maintain their own website. The collapse of the dot-com market in 2000 required the company to shift from a retail model to an indirect sale model to conserve capital. Brown the oversaw a series of acquisitions averaging one per year for a decade. The largest of the acquired companies was NetObjects, a Redwood City, California based software company best known for developing the web design tool NetObjects Fusion. Website pros purchased the company including its GoBizGo and NetObjects Matrix assets. In October 2001, for an undisclosed amount website, Pros acquired the spoken based e commerce service provider in Newty in 2002, resulting in the major company's change from an upfront fee structure to monthly subscription. The company was growing by 40% annually by 2003 and had 260 employees around 150 in Jacksonville and 110 in Spokane. By the end of the year, Website Pros received 16, 17 million in venture capital, which included $10 million in December 2003 from Inside Venture Partners and $7 million Norwest in April 2004. The Jacksonville Business Journal reported that Website Pros had 40,000 clients including Discover Business Services and IBM. At the time, the company secured funding from Norway's Brown Began preparing website website pros for an initial public offering in 2004. And the company went public in 2005 
website prosec code ebos and leads.com and reported 37.8 million dollars in sales in 2005 in 2006 julius genach works she joined web.com's board along with hug m durden and g harry durity website pros acquired the canadian company one shopping cart.com which offers a software e-commerce services for 12.5 million dollars as well as renex an online lead generation provider for contractors and homeowners in late 2006 in 2007 website pros acquired the atlanta based company web.com which was founded in 1981 and formerly known as interland.inc under the agreement which was valued at uh, around 129 million website pros paid 25 million dollars in cash and the rest in stock brown continued to serve as chairman and ceo of the merge company and jeff stribble who was serving as president and ceo of web.com became a president and board member of website pros the company remained headquartered in jacksonville and the merger resulted in a more than threefold increase in the number of paid subscriptions subscribers web.com group uh, website pros changed its name to web.com grouping in early 2008 in june the company began trading as www on nasdaq executive incorporated the change by closing the stock exchange at times square at nasdaq market site on june 9 stable served as president until 2009 web.com had nearly 1 million subscribers and was earning 120 million dollars in revenue by the end of 2010 in 2012 the company became the sponsor of the web.com tour a development professional golf tour for the us based pga tour in a deal that extends through 2021 in conjunction with the tour web.com hosts summits or designated spaces for people to meet company representatives and learn about its offering web.com hosted 27 of these events in 2013 financial news and daily record reported that the company had 500 employees in jacksonville plus an additional 1400 in satellite offices in october 2012 by 2014 web.com had 2000 employees in the us canada the uk and argentina Web.com Customer Service Center in Drums, Pennsylvania opened in January 2006. The company opened a digital customer service center in New Glasgow's Aberdeen's Business Center in September 2016. The office became Web.com's third call center in Nova Scotia. The company also has offices in Halifax and Yarmouth. Web.com generated 710.5 million dollars in revenue in 2016 and increased from 543.5 million dollars in 2015 in march 2017 the international customer management institute and named web.com a finalist in the best large contact center category at its annual global contact center awards which recognize companies and individuals that honor leadership's vision innovations and strategic accomplishment within the customer service industry in may 2017 the company relocated 175 employees within scottside costdale arizona sky Skong development into sky song for building yodel which was acquired by web.com in 2016 had moved into sky song in 2009 the new Sky Song 4 office space will house administrative and sales operation. The company was reportedly approached by private equity firms about a possible buyout in 2017. Acquisition and partnership, if we take that, in recent years, Web.com has grown via acquisition. The company acquired Solid Cactus, a provider of e-commerce and other online solutions. 
buzzword in 2009 web.com occurred register.com in 2010 435 million dollars resulting in an 80 percent increase in revenue and a fourfold increase in the number of customers the company's Officers in drums were formerly occupied by Network Solutions. A domain registration company occurred by Web.com in 2011 for $405 million and 18 million stock shares. The acquisition increased Web.com's customer base to 3 million people. The number of domains under its management in 9 million and the number of employees to nearly 2,000. Web.com executives rank the closing bill as the nasdaq market site on february february 28 2012 to commemorate the company's acquisition of network solution web.com acquired snap names and expired domain name service and marketplace and has 50 percent partnership with right side in namejet the company acquired scoot.com the largest online business directory network in the uk in july 2014 Web.com purchased Brightside domain. Sorry, in July 2014, uh, yeah, in 2000 July 2014, Web.com purchased Brightside domain name Drop List Registrar Accreditation for 1.3 million dollars and acquired the New York-based marketing services firm Yardley for more than 300 million. The purchase mark web.com largest acquisition by volume to date with 1400 employees in december 2016 the company expanded into latin america by agreeing to acquire the argentina based downweb.com for eight dollars million the B deal was completed in february 2017 on november 2000 uh, number 14 2019 web.com closed its acquisition of Deemscape Networks Limited. Number 6. Squarespace Squarespace Inc. is an American website building and hosting company which is based in New York City, USA. It provides software as a service for website building and hosting and allows users to use pre-built website templates and drag and drop elements to create and modify web pages. In 2004, Anthony Casalena founded Squarespace as a blog hosting service while attending the University of Maryland College Park. He was its only employee until 2006 when it reached $1 million in revenue. The company grew from 30 employees in 2010 to 550 by 2015. By 2014, it raised a total 78.5 million in venture capital, added uh, e-commerce tools, domain name services, and analytics, and replaced its coding backend with drag and drop features. It began trading on the New York Stock Exchange on May 19, 2021. According to the W3T text, Squarespace is used by 1.9% of the top 10 million websites. Casalena began developing Squarespace for his personal use while attending the University of Maryland. He started sharing it with friends and family members and participated in a business incubator program at university in January 2004. He launched Squarespace as do-it-yourself drag and drop website builder for the public. With a $30,000 seed fund from his father, a small grant from the university and 300 beta testers who paid a discounted rate at that time, Casalena was the company's sole developer and employee and worked out of his dorm room. By the time Casalena graduated in 2007, Squarespace was making annual revenues of $1 million. He moved to New York City, began hiring, and had 30 employees by 2010. That year, Squarespace received $38.5 million in its first round of venture capital funding led by Index Ventures and Asil Partners 
enabling it to hire more staff, continue to develop its software and double its marketing budget. From 2009 to 2012, it grew an average of 266% in yearly revenue. In April 2014, it received another $40 million in funding by 2015. It had reached under $9 million in revenue and 550 employees. Scarespace purchased Super Bowl advertising spots in 2014, 15, 16, 17, and 2018. Its 2017 had won an Emmy Award for Outstanding Commercial. In 2017, it signed a sponsorship deal with the New York Knicks to add the Squarespace logo to their uniform. After the Unite the Right Rally in 2017, Squarespace received a petition with 58,000 signatures and removed a group of websites for violating its terms of service against bigotry or hatred towards demographic groups. In 2017, it raised an additional $200 million in funding, boosting its value to $1.7 billion. This funding was earmarked for reacquiring interest from investors. In 2018, Scarspace partnered with the Madison Scar Garden Company to launch the Make It Awards, which award $30,000 to entrepreneurs. Scarspace acquired appointment scheduling company Acuity Scheduling in April 2019, followed by the acquisition of Unfold, an app allowing users to editorialize their social media content in October 2019. In April 2021, the company bought hospitality industry management platform Talk for more than $400 million. In early 2021, the company filed paperwork with the U.S. Securities and Exchange Commission to go public through direct listing on the New York SC under the symbol SQSP. In March 2021, Scarspace raised $300 million in a round of funding led by Dragonia, Tiger Global, D1 Capital, Partners and Fidelity Management and Research Company with participation from existing investors. This funding record valued the company at $10 billion. US dollars. As of to December 2020, Scarspace had more than 3 million subscriptions. Its users employ pre-built website templates and a variety of drag and drop widgets to add elements such as text and images. Its developers also create custom templates that are sold to users on screen instruction walk users through things like search engine optimization and setting up e-commerce services. Its services are in direct competition with wordpress.com, wix.com and other digital website building agencies. Scarspace was initially built for creating and hosting blogs e-commerce features such as an integration with stripe for accepting credit card payments were added in 2013 in 2014 more commerce features were added a mobile version of the service was released a separate facility was added for developers writing custom templates and features and a logo creation app was introduced in partnership with icon designer known project in 2011, Scarspace was upgraded to version 6 with new templates, a grid-based user interface, and other enhancements. Version 7, which went live in 2014, replaced its coding backend with a drag-and-drop interface, and added integration with Google Workspace, formerly G Suite, and Google Apps for Work, and getting images. In 2016, Scarspace started selling domains, putting it in more direct competition with GoDaddy and added an analytics dashboard and PayPal. At number 7, Network Solutions is an American based technology company and a subsidiary of Web.com. 
the fourth largest dot com domain name registered with over 6.7 million registration as of august 2018 in addition to being a domain name register network solutions providers provides web services such as web hosting web design and online marketing including search engine optimization and pay per click management Network Solutions started as a technology consulting company incorporated by Emmett McHenry with T.Y. Grigsby, Gary Dessler and Ed Peters in Washington, D.C. in 1979. In its first few years, the company focused on systems programming services, primarily in the IBM environment. Annual revenues passed $1 million in 1982, growing to $18.5 million in 1986. Network Solutions Inc. first operated the domain name system registry under a subcontract with the U.S. Defense Information Systems Agency in September 1991. NSI gave out names in the .com.org. Mil.gov.edu and .net top level domains for free, along with free internet protocol, IP address blocks, the network information center at SRI International had performed the work under the Elizabeth J. Feinler since 1972. In 1992, NSI was the sole bidder on a grant grant from the National Science Foundation to further develop the domain name registration service for the internet in 1993. NSI was granted an exclusive contract by the NSF to be the sole domain name registered for .com, .net and .org. A continuation of work NSI had already been doing, NSI also maintained the central database of assigned names called WHOIS, a contract was given to Boeing to operate the .mil TLT registry and was also performed by NSI under subcontract. In May 1993, the NSF privatized the domain name registry. Network Solution was the only bidder on $5.9 million annual contract to administratory. In March 1995, the company was acquired by Science Application International Corporation for $4.7 million. At that time, the company managed 60,000 domain names. At number 8, Nexus. Nexus is a popular web hosting company that has been in business for nearly a quarter century. It has more than 500,000 websites under management and operates eight data centers around the globe, making it one of the largest and most popular hosting options. Nexus is located in an Arbor, Michigan, United States. Uh, Nexus, oh, they offer various uh, Hosting optimized for, for the industries. Uh, they uh, provide WordPress, WooCommerce, Magento as well. Uh, they have uh, benefits uh, for the uh, WooCommerce experience beautiful and customizable designs, premium curated Woo plugins, automatic updates and maintenance, security and performance monitoring and they have 24 by 7 and 365 days uh, customer support uh, let's see uh, what the customers has to say about nexus they, uh, uh, the CEO Joe Howard founder and CEO of WP Buffs said managed WooCommerce on nexus is the high performance platform you need if you are running a serious WooCommerce shop. They have managed WooCommerce hosting scales for $5 million plus online stores. So for our clients that need that kind of power, Nexus is the partner we trust to take care of business. And the CTO and founder Natalico, Mr. 
Mark Lewis has said, Nexus managed Magento is saving us time, and for me, time is money. I would rather spend that time taking care of requests or new requirements that will drive business for them. At number 9, Cloudways. Cloudways is a web hosting system in that allows individuals as well as companies to launch their internet sites on the internet merely and rapidly. Making a best option of hosting solution can be fairly challenging, specifically when you have plenty of choice. It's generally an inquiry of stabilizing functions and also efficiency against price. The exact same goes for picking the very best clouding, cloud hosting platform besides having a clock look at another web hosting evaluation several of which you can find in the host section you should have a look at all of the functions on your own via a test this enables you to understand whether the platform matches you very own certain requirements in order to pick the most effective hosting system for introducing your online business you should first determine your hosting demands cloudways is uh, taken care of cloud hosting platform it offers consumers with the solution of launch internet applications on different cloud servers pricing demands upon the supplier you choose with digital ocean beginning at, at ten dollars each month cloudway servers are extremely tuned for performance as well as dependability and also you will have support professionals at all sell to help there are five cloud companies that cloud first offers now digital ocean three day totally free test well vulture three day cost free test linode three day totally free test amazon web solution aws three day free test google compute engine or google cloud three day total free test we would certainly recommend inspecting several of the above cloud web hosting and web server evaluation to see which one would certainly function best for your details demand no credit card is needed to do a cloud waste test however bear in mind that with the manager hosting you will obtain assist with whatever platform you choose prior to your begin introducing a server you will need to choose an internet application an internet application permits you to create a website based on your company's needs from wordpress to joomla and drupal we'll see uh, what are the customers else to say the cloud based customers is to say about their service the ability for a digital agency like us to have a lot of servers from different providers depending on the need in one place John Falzer, managing director of Keen, has said that, uh, and we'll have a look uh, what the CEO, CTO at Pacific Community has said. Cloudways made it easy for us to extend our web application infrastructure into the cloud. And Robert the Doro, CEO at SF, SFP, has said. We are grateful to have found an ideal managed cloud hosting platform from our customers and look to grow our hosting business through Crowdways. And Edward Bull, director at Limsharp, Limsharp has said, the ability to scale and clone sites ourselves and install SSL certificates give us more control. And founder at Telefi, Mr. Amit Khodari has said, Cloudbase has fulfilled our expectation. It is a great service and keeps our website up and running nicely. And uh, next, founder at Jostlex Studios, Mr. Jeff Wies has said, We gave Cloudbase a try and we saw our client sites have page load time decreased from an average of 5.4 seconds to just one over one seconds and uh, let's have a look what miss letty flat owner at letty's kitchen has said the support is excellent 
I have needed their help and they always come through. I have no technical brain and the back end of my website is all confusing. So I need the engineer help when something breaks. And uh, what Gabriela Mark Colongo has said, uh, founder at Inquilin, we love being part of the Cloudways family. We encourage all startups to switch to Cloudways managed hosting platform for a hassle-free hosting experience. At number 10, DreamHost. DreamHost is a Los Angeles-based web hosting provider and domain name registrar. It is owned by New Dream Network, founded in 1996 by Dallas Burton, Joe Stones, Michael Rodriguez, and Sage Wade. Undergraduate students at Harvey Mudd College in Claremont, California, and registered in 1997 by Michael Rodriguez. DreamHost began hosting customer sites in 1997. In May 2012, DreamHost spun off Ink Tank. Ink Tank is a professional service and support company for the open source CEPH file system. In November 2014, DreamHost spun off Akanda and open source network virtualization project as of February 2016. DreamHost employs about 200 people and has close to 400,000 customers. And these are our top 10 uh, web hostings and please let us know in our comments if you uh, enjoy the video and please subscribe our channel for more videos.